What you looking at, John? Uh, oh, no, 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 nothing. Uh... They're old friends of mine, and they've requested your assistance with a giant problem. Oh, yeah? What's that? Giants. Dark things called dark things. So in a world before the MCU and DCU and everything connecting with each other, we just had standalone comic book movies where it was nothing more and nothing less than just the character itself in their own world and no connecting tissue and no wider story that's being told. Now when it comes to Hellboy, so far we've had two films with Ron Perlman directed by Guillermo del Toro, one reboot with David Harbour which was wild in a bad way, and now we have a new take on the character with Jack Kessie taking on the demon in Hellboy the Crooked Man. Something in these hills. Something haunted. Evil. It smells like death. Now I haven't read the comic that the film's based on. I'll check it out before I watch the film. But it's definitely clear that after the David Harbour one flop, the studio has decided to scale back the films a bit more when it comes to its budget and story. Instead of going on a fantasy adventure with a high budget, it looks like it's going to tap in into its horror roots and have a singular story in one location without going crazy with the budget. Now the trailer looks okay in my opinion, it's not finished yet, um, and I can't wait for it to come out, so I'll definitely check it out. We've got company. All oh, your friends. They all gonna die. <laughs> 